I'm going to put some marshmallows in a vacuum bag and suck the air out. But then I'm going to take that bag full of marshmallows and put in the vacuum chamber to see if there's secretly still some air in there. Normally, if you put a marshmallow in a vacuum chamber, it blows up like a balloon and then kind of deflates as it pops all the little sugar cells it's made of. But I don't know exactly what's going to happen if it's inside this bag. There you go. Doesn't really look like there's any air in there, but let's find out. If there is, the vacuum chamber should make it blow up like a balloon. Oh, we can see the air inside the marshmallows starting to expand. Oh yeah, look at that. It pulled air out of the marshmallows into the bag and now the bag itself is just blowing up like a balloon. With a thin, weak bag, it's possible to pop the bag entirely, but I don't know if these are weak enough for that to happen. Let's let the air back in and see what that does. <laughs> Look at that, deflated sort of raisin-like marshmallows in a bag with just a little bit of extra air in it. Mmm, shriveled and dense, just how I like them. What else do you want to see us put in the vacuum chamber?